All right, guys, we're here at Full Performance Marine. Check this boat out. This is the all new 2021 Yamaha 255 FSH Sport. The all new center console. Take a look how deep this boat is. This thing is gonna handle rough water really, really well. All righty, let's uh, take a look at this beast here. You see the uh, sea deck snap-in mat all along the cockpit there. We got the built-in cooler. We have a nice aerated uh, live well here. It's gonna be on the starboard side. Opposite port side here, we have the battery switches and a really nice storage compartment. Everything's tucked away nice and clean. Turn those battery switches on. So you can get this boat in uh, the all black for 2021. You can also get it in the uh, teal color with the uh, the warm interior, which is like a uh, kind of like a mocha and espresso interior. Both look very sharp, but the black obviously is uh, the more sportier color. Take a look at the uh, speakers and spreader lights in the uh, T-top there. Jump in the cockpit here. So this is the uh, the first time that Yamaha has partnered with a uh, electronics company like uh, like Simrad. So you get the full Simrad screen. We also have the Yamaha Connect screen here. We got the phone holder right there. Still gives you the Yamaha uh, no wake mode cruise control. This is the E series, so it's going to give you digital fly by wire controls. Uh, one key, and it's going to have the uh, push button start and stop mode there. Speakers on the side of the uh, console there. Rod holders in the gunnel. We have another uh, live well here, nice clear case. You can see that all the way down through. Very nice and deep, completely sealed off. Uh, it's nicely finished too. It's 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 not the. Uh, you know, it's not the typical Yamaha boat that you're accustomed to. This one was overbuilt and it was meant for rough water and they really hit all the points that, uh, you know, the customers have been asking for on this particular model. Take a look at the table there, an oversized table. We do have storage underneath all those seats there as well. Sea deck everywhere that you, they can put it. Nice little tabletop surface here if you want to grill out. Stick a grill on there. If you want to stick an additional fish finder out there, you got plenty of room for it. We're gonna open this up. See a trash can on that side that is removable. We've got your tackle drawers over here. We also have a sliding net drawer there. Notice how everything is this maintenance free composite material. This stuff's not gonna mildew. It's not gonna uh, fade, not gonna stain. And it's extremely durable and lightweight. We have a uh, floor locker here. We'll pick this up in the bow. Take a look at that there. All nice and finished off. Nice deep compartment there. Like I said, storage underneath all those seats up in the front as well. You can see the front seat on the uh, front of the console there. We're gonna lift this up. Nice changing room feature there if you don't want that up all you gotta do is pull this right off and just use it all for storage but you can see how big it is in there and there's a curtain a curtain here in front of this this curtain will actually pull down and you can get access to all your gauges wiring everything is in there so uh you don't have to take any kind of panels down or anything if you need to you know replace the electronics after a few years replace the radio gauges Everything is easily accessible right there. So we'll come around the starboard side here. You see we got another speaker over here, more rod holders with the cutout in the uh, T-top for the uh, rod tips to fill in. We have the uh, raw water wash down and fresh water option, uh, raw wash down on this boat. That's something that only the 255 series is gonna give you. Take a look at this uh, underneath the seat storage here. So there's your water pump, air cleaner. That would be 
for your uh, fresh water wash down. And uh, here's what everybody wants to see. You want to see these uh, twin supercharged engines? Let's take a look and uh, see what they look like in the uh, 255 FSH Sport. So that's that right there. We have twin supercharged, 500 horsepower total. This boat is absolutely going to rip. This is the same engine that they're putting in the uh, GP1800 SVHO, the racing performance jet skis. Very, very reliable. It's going to give you a lot of low end torque. And, uh, you know, we have this boat completely loaded up with bait, your gear and everything. Those engines aren't going to work very hard to uh, keep this boat up on plane. So there it is. Take a look at the helm again. Take a look at these two uh, captain seats here. See, it does have a flip up bolster. The FSH logo there, right in front. Very, very impressed with this boat. We're gonna get the key on here and uh, we're gonna turn on the dashes and kind of go over that as well. So we got the master power key right down here. So I'm gonna turn this master power on. I'm gonna get all these gauges turned on here. So you can see right away the Yamaha Connect screen. We have the uh, volume over here for the stereo fuel, the RPMs on each engine, port, starboard, speed in the middle. And then as soon as you uh, turn the engines on, this volume control is gonna go to uh, depth. Fuel economy, trip distance, gallons used, fuel flow. It's going to give you a bunch of different options there. It also has um, like a water sports mode. We got wake slalom, wake surf, wake board. You can have your settings in there if you want to wake board at 22 mile an hour. Fast acceleration. Save that right there. Go ahead and set it. If you don't like to accelerate real fast, you can manually do it. Or you can do a slow acceleration. I mean, there's everything in this boat. It's it's not just a fishing boat. You can do everything on this. There's your stereo controls right there. Click down on source. You can go in the Bluetooth, weather, auxiliary, AM, radio. As you menu, menu there, you go through all your different options, the brightness of the screen and things like that. You can click on the uh, controls here for the remote. Click on that twice while it's running. We can go into single, single lever mode, so we can grab just one throttle. So right now I'm grabbing two throttles, pushing both in forward gear. So once we hit click on the single lever mode, we can grab just one throttle, put it in forward, and it's gonna keep the RPMs 100% exactly matching in sync. Really nice feature, and uh, you, know, you know, if you're gonna go on some long cruises, that, that's a really nice feature to use. Take a look at the Simrad screen here. We just got that turned on. It's really nice. It says FSH series there, big and bright. So while that's loading up here, we'll take a look at all your switches. We've got the fresh water, raw water wash down, aft and forward live well, underwater lights, spreader lights, your mapping lights, courtesy lights. It's a lot of different information that uh, this boat is going to give you. screen load up real quick here all right so accept all right so there's your mapping system we'll uh, zoom out on that got your depth up the side of water temperature the date click up here it's gonna give you your, your, your different apps charge charts you got your side view navigation I mean everything you want is on this on this boat here so there's your uh, navigation chart you can zoom in and out on that it's really nice Let's see if we can find a lake here right there so there's there's Lake Raystown wow that's a really nice view it's gonna show you the different ba bodies of water that has uh, different angles and depths in there going to go to a darker blue when it gets a little bit more shallow it's going to show you some flooded timber uh, down there 
Over here, some flooded timber. I mean, wow, this, this, this is a very elaborate, very nice and high definition screen as well. Very impressed with that Simra. That's the first time I've had it on. It's a really nice feature. A few more options on this side here. Go to down scan. It's going to be just like a, uh, you know, a fish finder menu right there. It might be hard to read without sitting on the, uh, without being in the water. We're out in the parking lot right now. So it's reading the, uh, you know, the black top, which is really hot right now. So a lot of different functionalities you have on that. Yeah. Guys, I think we're uh, pretty excited about this boat and I'm uh, looking forward to getting more in. Give us a call at 814-658-BOAT if you'd like some more information on this boat or any other Yamaha boat we have in stock. You can view our entire website online at fullperformancemarine.com. Please like and subscribe to our channel.